What is up YouTube? This is DemonCat67 with another Call of Duty Black Ops 2 video. Um, previously I did uh, Buried, but um, I wasn't able to finish uh, the match just because um, I feel like this is kind of repetitive, but um, I wasn't able to finish the match because I had to do something, so I'm really sorry about that. But Anyways, um, I'm just going to play a whole match. I'm not even going to put it into parts because I'm going to make it short and sweet for you guys. Um, so you could all watch it in all in one video instead of uh, individual videos. So here we go. We're going to play Buried. I'm going to explain to you the lore and everything. Of course, sub for sub. Uh, love that. Uh, Twitter, Facebook, Google Plus accounts will be up soon. So just wait for that. Links in the description. Just going to go to Zombies. All right, here we are at the Black Ops 2 Zombies menu. We're just gonna we're just gonna do a system link here. Make it simple. Gonna go to buried, of course. And we're in. Uh, if you look closely, it says resolution 1295, which means um, that's the name of the project for uh, this map. The miners um, went. We're digging, as you can tell, it's a mine miner base. And they were digging underground to find a uh, village, an underground uh, western village, trapped underground since 1295. Um, I guess since the tectonic plates shifting or something like that got it trapped underground. And of course, the rift occurred, quote, and the rocket hit, and that caused everybody to die. And uh, it made the the base is still operational, um, but there's nobody there except the undead. But except our survivors who stumble across it and find out what's hidden beneath the surface so let's start this match and one of the things I like about this map is the haunted mansion I find that very uh, creepy how the girl just stares at you through the window um, I'll try to get into that mansion this match we'll see but anyways, this is Barry, and it looks like I am Samuel Steelinger. So without further ado, let's start the match. We came all this way to look at a big hole in the earth? course you start out um, above ground. Uh, you're not underground right away. If you look around, it's uh, obviously a, a miner base for miners digging underground. And if you go down there, you go down. But I'm not going to do that just yet, and you'll see why. I can handle myself, believe me! And it turns out this map uh, is a big hit. People love it, so... Um, you know, I started playing it myself, and I thought it was pretty cool, so uh, I thought I'd play it. What are all these huge machines? Do they serve some grand purpose? look down here, that is the rift I was talking about, where uh, the rocket from Moon, if you remember from the Easter egg, when the rockets launched, 
when Rick Tofen launched the Rockets and also took Samantha's place as the demonic announcer. I already explained that story in a video I did a while ago. Um, that was uh, one of the rocket impacts. If you look in the background, um, occasionally you can see meteors flying through the sky, which is just excess debris from the uh, impact. So, usually like stay until round four, or I, I mean like even after round three, so let's see. I really wish the pistol had its full cartridge right when you spawn because it would really be useful. I'm gonna go uh, right now because I don't think I'll last. Uh... See that, guys? I just got the uh, LSAT, which is an awesome um, heavy machine gun. Heavy machine gun, whatever the heck you call it. So I'm gonna get myself a quick revive, and that's how you get the LSAT, which I just showed you up there. A little pick me up. Sure, gonna get not? the chalk, and I have to do that for the points. I actually I don't need the Remington shotgun right now. Samuel, shut up. Um, people can hear me. Maybe my other weapon has some bullets. Now, if you look around, here we are down in the underground old western town, and I'm gonna get myself a mystery box gun. Let's see what I get here. Oh, this pistol, the Remington new model army, is uh, actually new to this map, which I like because the map is a western town. It's kind of a cowboy-themed pistol. You all die now! Right now! This moment. It's a very strong pistol. I like it. So I'm going to go right now and free this uh, really big freaky guy um, from his cell. All you got to do is... All you gotta do is grab the key and then unlock the jail cell. Um, if a guy that big is scared, what does that tell you? If you once he uh, opens the cell, once you open the cell, he'll cower in the corner. And then after that, you just gotta I grab the booze. This perfectly good booze here, anyway. Give him to him, and he will burst open that little thing of debris right there. Don't see an easy way out of this one. <laughs> And then uh, from there on, you can give him candy or booze, and when you do, he will follow you. Candy uh, makes him rage and like kill zombies, and booze makes him clear debris, such as this, by running into it. And by that, I mean unviable debris, like, uh, you know, not debris you can clear with your points. You freaks are no match for my trusty little six-shooter! And if you're Samuel... When you get this Remington gun, you'll notice that he starts talking uh, like a cowboy once he gets this gun, so that must reveal something about his character. Ammo! Free ammo! That's about as good as it gets! Good. Let's go make some money! There's some new guns to this map that I, that I already know. Um, there is the Paralyzer to start off, which is the amazing wonder weapon. I really do love that. So I believe it has a limited ammo. I may be wrong, but I believe it does have a limited ammo. Um, it's just that if you use it straight through for a while, it'll have to charge back up, and that takes uh, some time. So, but it still has unlimited ammo, so after it recharges, um, you'll be able to use it again until it has to... Again, reach out. And then another gun is the... Don't let the fact I don't have a hat confuse you. I'm still a cowboy at heart! The next new gun is the Ray Gun Mark II, which surprised a lot of us zombie gamers. A lot of us loved it. And if you do... I'm the fastest gun um, there is! If you do buy this uh, map pack, the Vengeance map pack, and get the zombie map area... Yeah, how good I am at this! With the season pass, or with your uh, own Microsoft points, or PlayStation points, or whatever you call it, um, 
you will Why get the uh, one thing to drive me to our You oh, will get little freaks will be in trouble when our friend shows up. You will get the ray gun mark two in all your other maps. So like transits and stuff like that, if you purchase this map pack, you will get the ray gun mark two in all of those, which I think is really, really cool. Um Love the Ray Gun Mark 2. I might, I might get it in this video. I'm not now sure. God, this is so freaking annoying. This guy keeps talking. Like, seriously. Every kill, he's like talking. But, anyways, um, after the Ray Gun Mark 2 no, and the no. Paralyzer, there's Total the. Work, you magic invisible hand. After the Ray Gun Mark II and the Paralyzer, there is the Time Bomb, which is also new, and I love that as well. Um, because it allows you to go back in time to whenever you threw it. So if you're about to die, and like, and you're on, say you're on round 10, you can go back, you can use your Time Bomb to go back to like round 4 or whatever when you threw it. Saves your ass, so I, I kind of like that. Can't that big goon do something about these stuffy little bastards? Just gonna hang around here, kill zombies around here until I uh I'm the fastest gun there is! decide uh, that I want to move on. Cause I'm really loving this pistol right now. He's weak, weak, kill him! Still got my quick revive too. Once you go to the other side of the map, um, the little mistress will start talking to you, the haunted little lady who uh, lives in that mansion, if you can see there. She uh, is kind of creepy. She talks to you in your head on that side of the map, on this debris. It can be both creepy and annoying, I guess. But I need Why'd you make us wait so long? Got a max ammo for this uh, pistol that I'm really liking here. Now, if you listen closely, the little mistress lady will start talking to me in my head. I'll let you listen to that. Listen 
closely and you can hear the music. Giant guy, I believe there's candy in here somewhere. Candy or booze or something like that in this room. This little candy shop. The tin's out, board up some windows. There we go, see that guy's candy? Hey, I found some candy! Going to find the little. He can give it to this guy. He starts following you, see? He won't stop following me. See all this candy? And I'm going to give it to him once I'm uh, trapped by the zombies. For my trusty little six shooter. Uh, because when you're trapped by zombies, when you give him the candy, he like rages and like. freaking ballistics all of the zombies and like. Kills them all, so that's that's what candy is useful for. And on the other hand, the booze just uh, makes them clear the debris. I love when I shoot off shoot shoot off. The zombie's top hat. It's just, I, I think it's kind of funny how they're wearing the top hats now with Fancy. From like the olden days. You see how good I am at this? It's pretty, uh, a lot of features, a lot of details that Treyarch has added to this map. It really impresses me. see that they've gone from uh, Noxter and Totem to this map. It just shows how much hard work. the fact that I don't have a hat confuse you. It just shows how uh, much hard work. Ah, crap. I just made that. Well, like missed the bus. I just made the little guy go in his cell again. I accidentally threw a grenade at him. So when that happens, you got to find a key. To open it again, see, yeah, uh, runs like a pansy in there and hides in there. So, oh, oh, my God. that was Don't count as housework. he going? But what is that zombie? Oh my god. Okay. Even if you lived, it wouldn't have been a very fulfilling life. I was like, what? Where is he going? Sometimes that happens, though. Like, zombies will occasionally, uh... Oh, great. Give me a nuke on the last zombie the round that really helps. Looks like I'm going to have to get myself a new gun, because this thing's running out. Yeah, listen, I'm totally gonna take that. Um, otherwise, get the nuke, anyways. Oh, they all got lit up. I think I'm forced to buy this B23R and stick with that for a little bit. I like this pistol; it's, it's nice, I guess. But I also have my LSAT, so I can't get that. Ah! Holy shit! 
it. Take it easy there, I gotta slow down. You ain't touching me with a shitty stick! You don't have to do it! This uh, pistol, if you really uh, put it, uh, put it to good use. Round, round ten right now, guys. for the early rounds, I guess. Let me try the box again. You smell a whole lot fucking better when you've been heated up a little, pal! Nope, not taking that. Not for this gun, at least. How much people use that now because of the galvan knuckles? This thing runs out of ammo really quickly though, I do not like that. Going up into the little uh, train passageway here. Get my way back uh, to the. Holy crap! Was not paying attention there, guys. Sorry about that. Looks like it's time to break out my LSAT because uh, a lot of zombies come in with ammo.
Yes. Raygun Mark II, baby. Got my Raygun Mark II. I was talking about that earlier in the video. Show you what that can do in a little bit. Love that gun, though. In fact, I'll show you right now. Holy crap. Getting a little tight there. I make this jump up. I freaking dolphin dive. Oh, I didn't else. do anything. How about that little bitch, Merle? Oh, honestly, it's always something. Personally, I like the ray gun Mark II a lot better than the uh, first ray gun because when a zombie comes close to you and you need to kill it, it does not hurt you. Unlike the normal ray gun, when you when a zombie's close to you and you need to shoot it, the uh, bolt the blast is uh, too big to hurt you. So. Awesome, another max ammo. Max ammo! <laughs> the ammunition overlords bless us with their gifts! I have not been using this guy that much because, uh... I don't really want to get to the Haunted Mansion right now or any of those places. I just want to make it far. The little uh, tune in my head is playing again. Again, it wouldn't Man, jump. I don't even like it. Holy crap, that was lucky right there for me. Here, maybe it's 
See, look, here's booze right here. Uh, I suppose I'd rather take this. I just traded my candy for that. Whoa, that was unfair. I can uh, slip in another quick revive. Over here. Oh, ah! Again! Well, that was a pretty uh, bad way to die. But, anyways, thank you for watching this video. Um, I will show you some multiplayer gameplay later. We made it to round 14. Uh, hopefully, I can provide more videos where I make it farther. You should make it farther than that. Thank you for watching this video, and sub for sub! look down here, that is the rift I was talking about, where uh, the rocket from Moon, if you remember from the Easter egg, when the rockets launched, when Richtofen launched the rockets and also took Samantha's place as the demonic announcer, I already explained that story in a video I did a while ago, um, that was uh, one of the rocket impacts, if you look in the background. Um, Occasionally, you can see meteors flying through the sky, which is just excess debris from the uh, impact. So, usually, like, stay until round four. Or, I, I mean, like, even after round three, so let's see. What is up, YouTube? This is DemonCat67 with another Call of Duty Black Ops 2 video. Um, previously, I did uh, Buried. But, um, I wasn't able to finish, uh, the match, just because, um, I feel like this is kind of repetitive, but, um, I wasn't able to finish the match because I had to do something, so I'm really sorry about that. But, anyways, um, I'm just gonna play a whole match, I'm not even gonna put it into parts because I'm gonna make it short and sweet for you guys. Um, so you could all watch it in all in one video instead of, uh, individual videos. So here we go, we're gonna play Buried, I'm gonna explain to you the lore and everything. Of course, sub for sub, uh, love that, uh, Twitter, Facebook, Google Plus accounts will be up soon, so just wait for that, links in the description. Just gonna go to Zombies. find out what's hidden beneath the surface, so let's start this match. And one of the things I like about this map is the haunted mansion. I find that very uh, creepy, how the girl just stares at you through the window. Um, I'll try to get into that mansion this match, we'll see. But anyways, this is Barry, and it looks like I am Samuel Steelinger. So without further ado, let's start the match. We came all this way to look at a big hole in the earth? you start out um, above ground. Uh, you're not underground right away. If you look around, it's uh, obviously a, a miner base for miners digging underground. And if you go down there, you go down. But I'm not going to do that just yet, and you'll see why. I can handle myself, believe me! And it turns out this map uh, is a big hit. People love it, so... Um, you know, I started playing it myself, and I thought it was pretty cool, so uh, I thought I'd play it. Where are 
all these huge machines? Do they serve some grand purpose? Alright, here we are at the Black Ops 2 Zombies menu. We're just gonna we're just gonna do a system link here. Make it simple. Gonna go to buried of course. And we're in uh, if you look closely it says resolution twelve ninety five, which means um, that's the name of the project for uh, this map. The miners um, went were digging as you can tell it's a mine miner base. And they were digging underground to find a uh, village, an underground uh, western village, trapped underground since 1295. Um, I guess since the tectonic plates shifting or something like that got it trapped underground. And of course, the rift occurred, quote, and the rocket hit, and that caused everybody to die. And uh, it made the the base is still operational, um, but there's nobody there except the undead. But except our survivors who stumble across it and 